Dear Lord. Missions. Do I need to re-accept, probably? Deploy. Mission accepted. Alright. So specifically. Uh walks in barracks. So it's just either of those. Those bo both seem valid starting spots. Alright. Pick one arbitrarily. I got new equipment, right? Items. Duh, duh, duh. No, not items. I got new grenades. Which are tools? No. Secondary weapons. Primary weapons. Support weapons. Where's my oh, smoke grenade? There we go. I must have just not seen it because I'm a blind person who doesn't understand what he's looking at with his eyeballs. Alright. So we have C4, which I think I might be out of. No, I have more of it now. It must restock automatically. Hand grenade, smoke grenade, magazine. Where's my boxes at? Oh, that, those must be items. Oh, I mixed up support weapons with items. So many menus. Alright. Secondary weapon. I already have the silence pistol. Primary weapon. Let's get a, let's, let's grab that uh, sniper rifle. Which I'll we'll probably find more immediate use out of than a machine gun. If I plan properly. Can I silence it is the question. That might be something I have to modify over time. It might not, might not be there by default. Let's get busy. Episode 5, Over the Fence. Boss, the Soviet engineer is being held prisoner at the Watson barracks. You need to find him and get him out. He tried to defect from the base camp up north, but it didn't work out. Now they're holding him at Watson. He's offered his technical skills to us as long as we can guarantee his safety. You have to extract the target. Always mixing up how to get to this part. All right. Boss, your target just happens to be the man who developed your prosthetic hand. And is the only one capable of maintaining it. If oh. you bring him in, I'm sure he'll be able to modify it in all kinds of ways as well. Well, that gives us a clear reason to prioritize him then. Be careful down there, boss. Do I look like someone who's careful? My face is completely drenched in blood. I apparently didn't have time to wipe it off in the like hours I may have been in that helicopter. Let's see. If we're going to expand Mother Base, we need more manpower. And not just for combat roles either. R&D, the support unit, Intel, each demands a different set of skills. If we want to achieve what we've set out to do, Diamond Dogs has got to get stronger. There's a Soviet engineer I want to have join us. He was the one who built your prosthesis. With him on our side, who knows what sort of enhancements he'll come up with for it. He tried to defect but didn't make it, and now he's being held prisoner at Wax. That's the Waxin Barracks. The target is somewhere inside that outpost. The Soviets consider him a traitor now, so he'll be treated like any other prisoner. So that's good news. He, uh, tried to defect. Which means he's someone who actually wants me to take them. That's a good- that's good for, uh, the whole stealing a person thing, if they actually are someone I'm freeing. It's one of the first pieces of advice I read about this game is that prisoners are like the first people you want to free because they're almost always like super effective people to have around, like they have all the high ranking stats. Anyone else around? Oh, oh there's one. No it is him, there we go. Oh there's two, didn't even see that one. That guy's got comms. Don't want him around. Gun. Gun? Nope. What all is around? Just that guy? Taking a quick look-see. Don't want to miss nobody. Although it'll be a lot harder to get in and get out with a person. Quietly. Unless I have an extraction point that I can use. If we go up the mountain, we might be able to get an extraction point. I think I'm done with horse. I think I am done with horse. Careful and quiet. Anyone around here where I couldn't see before? Not immediately. 
Alright, so we have to extract a dude that's being held prisoner. Kinda like Miller. Oh, that mission went alright. Got really dicey in that one building. Oh, there's more people, I'm sure. There we go. Got dicey in that one building where I was looking at some stuff because I thought I thought he might be in there. And then like one by one, like three people walked in, but I knocked them all out without killing them. Which for me is a measure of success. I'm not one for pr I'm not exactly the best person to watch for perfect runs. Hello. Oh. It's not Try to avoid that cone of influence. Alright. Going to make our way through carefully and quietly. And not get- Ooh! Drainage pipe! That seems useful to me. I bet I can take advantage of that in some way. Ooh! Diamonds, probably. It's like all the things that can help me. There's so much money just around everywhere. What a rich country, Afghanistan. <laughs> oh. Is that guy gonna look straight over here? You have arrived. Ooh, in the cone. Get in the cone. I love you, small thing. Whatever you are. Half pipe. On its side. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Anyone around? No one's really looking this way. As long as this guy doesn't spot me, I'm in good shape, I think. And he's pretty focused on his shiny light thing that's so distracting to him. The thing that is his fixture in all of his life. His his love, his bright light. Hello, Jeep that I should highlight. There we go. For later reference. Let's see here. Anyone here? All right, no one's spotting me yet. That's a good. Sh that's a good sign. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Anyone in this booth? No, booth is empty. Booth is empty, devoid of people. How we doing here? Eh? Got past their big guard covered in lights and everything. That's a good start. Can I sneak up here a bit? Okay. Okay. Not necessarily the most successful approach. What's flapping around? Is that the flag? Definitely part of it. Alright. Who, who have I spotted up here so far? Just those two? Does not mean they're the only ones. Gotta be careful about that. Ooh, this might be one up here. Nope. Empty. Quite empty. Alright, that gives me clear cover. Oh, this guy's walking by. Just be stealthy about it. This could be our big break. If he wanders out, then we have one last guy here. What does triangle do? What? It said triangle to human. I don't know what that button means. <laughs> Alright, he's gonna stop there, isn't he? He's gonna stop there. I got this, brah. Right, he's in my way, but I can... T if I take him down real quick... I can probably snatch him without anyone noticing. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. If I get him out of line of sight, can I extract him without anyone noticing? I haven't tested that really. I've only extracted one person during a mission so far that wasn't a main objective. And I did so right in, right in clear line of sight of somebody. See any... we gonna get any blinky... No blinky triangles indicating that they're on their way. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. I think that guy's mine. Something really creepy about the fact that I kidnapped my own personal army. You can't see me. I'm a an animate object that couldn't possibly be kidnapping your soldiers and repurposing them for his own devious needs. It's more fuel resources. I need to get a thousand of each to upgrade basically anything. All right. Well, that guy's not going to notice a whole lot where he is. Is he coming this way? No, he's just hanging out. 
Is this even where the doctor is? I assume he is. It's a big, suspicious building. Huh? Alright, he's in my way a bit. Not a big old fan of that. How do I deal with that problem? Do I just shoot him? Lols. <laughs> tactical box is tactical. Yeah, seems like a reasonable approach. Anyone here to watch him? No? Well, now he belongs to me. Alvita Zane. Alright, just gonna put him over, take him over here on the corner, just in case. I just don't want him getting spotted as I'm as I'm over there. All right, now we're in a whole new area because this is all inside of a building. Never seen the inside yet. I guess the stealthy, the, I guess the perfect stealth approach would probably be to go up that slope. Okay. I mean, I already did it, so yes, I am going to do that thing that I already did. Oh, there's a, there's a shipping container down there. Could that have something in it? Ooh, there's a whole cert there's a whole watchtower on the side. Stuff I never saw. So I'm gonna try to go up top first to scout out the next area, since it seems to be located here for a reason. Yep. Don't slip on me, Snake. I'll be very disappointed in you. Huh? You did it. You did it, Snake. You did it. After all I said, after all we were through together, tell me I can get up here. Ooh, plants. Anyone watching me? Nope. Your plants are mine. Sweet. What's up here? Oh, this place got elaborate. Is that Chinese? Uh, that's a diamond just on a table. You know, where you keep diamonds. Out in the open. Not claimed. Didn't even write his name on it. Alright. Hey, buddy. Shipping containers again. The hum. Oh, uh, that building's probably important. Yep. Probably want to put a bomb next to that communications thing. For later. That's what I should've done the last mission, is planted C4 by the communications. That, these are all soldier barracks, is right? The idea is that this whole place is swarming with soldiers, so if I alert everyone, we're gonna get attacked by a lot of people. So my goal should be to get to our goal in and out, and that's it. Ooh, should I turn off? Should I be wanting to turn off the, uh... Power? We could have fun with that, but maybe that kind of distraction... ...could actually lead to more people noticing me. Huh. Let's look at my route here. Oh, they swapped guards. That guy's new. Alright, so I want to get in that building that almost certainly has what I want in it. Everything out here is probably just a distraction, or a potential threat, if I alert everyone. But I also kinda wanna... I kinda wanna activate that power generator just for funsies. Anyone in here? Either destroy that, or turn it off to shut off all the lights and surveillance cameras in the outpost. But of course, the enemy will realize something's up. If you're gonna do it, be quick. Alright, there we go. It's getting a little confused about the menu here. There we go. I'm gonna try to circumvent the area for a bit. So I've placed the explosion. I don't want to be there when I put it off, though. I see you. Can I sneak through? I can. So I'm going for the bat. Oh, right, we have to watch out for, sc for security cameras if there are any. You mentioned security cameras. Oh, someone's sleeping in there. There's probably a lot of personal items I can steal if I go through these buildings. That's also gonna rapidly increase my chance of getting caught. That's also that tantalizing diamond just sitting on the freaking table in plain sight. The game will almost certainly be like, you didn't get the diamond? Wow, Snake, you're bad at climbing. Look at him sliding around like a crazy person. Alright. 
Behind wall there is nothing. Sweet. That means I can go here. Got like a little, sh little weird wooden structure for, for reasons. Oh, that goes up somewhere. Don't necessarily know why. All right, that's the structure I almost certainly want to be in. Let's look, at, let's look for cameras. Hello, communications dish. Probably gonna wanna put a bomb on you. Can I run up that and jump for the communications dish? Let's see. Can I be like, huh? Is there a jump in this game? Running X, no. Running circle. Running triangle, no. All right. Don't know if there's a jump in this game that'll help me in that specific situation. That diamond is out in the open. That goddamn diamond is out in the open now. All right. I don't see any guards that's gonna that are gonna spot me as I come in on this side. I don't see any any uh, camera blinky lights anywhere. It's their new stealth cameras. I mean, realistically, if you want to have cameras that don't get that actually work, you would just not make them easy to see. Cameras can be so small now. They can go inside. I mean, they're inside of phones. You only make you only make a big imposing security camera if you want people to be discouraged. All right, so that, I'm really tempted by those diamonds. But it's right in the open where everyone's gonna see me. So let's see what kind of progress I can make in this direction without it. Can I climb this? Apparently not. We have a staircase. Oh man, complicated structure. All right. Boss, you've entered a building. Always keep an escape route in mind when you head indoors. If you get surrounded, you'll have nowhere to run. Oh, I know that much. All right, bomb placed. To take care of the whole communications thing later. Probably on my way out. Let's lay down to decrease, invis decrease visibility. So lights are on in the building. Somewhere in here is probably the guy I'm trying to take. Uh, haven't seen anyone necessarily patrolling inside yet. You hear the crocodile out of the barragon. You're kidding. Really, this junk weapons got through the armor? No, I heard they use a man portable homing missile. Homing missile? The flares did nothing to stop it. How could they have such a thing? We only have eyewitness accounts. No one's got their hands on it yet. Uh, doctor, doctor. Tell me the news, because I got a bad case of not being able to fucking find you. Ooh. No. Fuck. Sadness happened. Well, there's a reasonable time to do this. Lols. Lights off, motherfuckers. You see me? <laughs> He's down there with the explosion. Crazy, huh? Alright, well that went, that went poorly. Passed one corner the wrong time, and everything went to shit. But at least all their power is out, so they can't use their cameras to detect me, as if that's the problem. Alright. What is this thing to do? What am I gonna jump on when I press that? Oh, they're coming. Alright. Oop! That's not what I was going for at all. There we go. So what are they aiming at right now? Doctor! What they shoot? What they throw that at? Now they're just being destructive. All right. So he's not above ground. He's below ground, probably. Hit. 
Oh shit! Oh shit! Nobody told me they knew they could see through my my masterful box technology. All right, shit. Hey, buddy. What if I shot you in the face? Would that be sweet? You like that? There we go. All right, things have gotten better in the past. Things have gotten quite better. There's so many of them. There are so many of them. Jujikaka! Uh oh. <laughs> doctor, doctor, show me. Ooh, Sandstorm. By Durande. Uh. E. Where's my. This is my smoke grenade. That's what I was going for. Fun time! Oh shit. Ow. Dude. Dude, chill. Haha, uh, you got smoked. Take that, dick. Take that. Getting back up. <laughs> what am I doing just now? Uh. Alright, well that went to shit pretty quickly. Ooh. Lols, they'll never spot me here. They, they, they know I'm here. I think they know I'm here. <laughs> uh, that's fine. We can. We just need another smoke grenade. But I just threw more smoke grenades. Zoom. Then I can be all like, I don't know. Uh, night vision goggles, bitch. Yeah. Science and shit, bitch. Oh god. Bad, 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 bad. Uh-oh. You guys can't get me. Ow, I called time out. You die now. Okay. You know, I think we got off on the wrong foot here. I think we got off on the wrong foot. I'd really appreciate it if you would just try to see things from my perspective. Which is that you guys have guns? There we go. Shh, I know it hurts. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Ew. I'm trying to stop your guy from having pain, dick. Ow. Stop it. Ow. Stop it. Stop it. You know what? You know what? You can't stick your little bullshit right now. You wanna come over here? You wanna play a game? What are you doing? You reloading? You reloading? Hey, buddy. Look, you covering your current your corner like some kind of professional or something. Oh shit, you have a surprise. You had a surprise up your sleeve? Yeah. What did I just do? That was magical. You done yet? You fucking done? Are, are, did I just kill you? I'm not sure. I'm not sure if he was dead or not. Hey, buddy. Oh, uh, did I take the silencer off this somehow? It's supposed to be silent. Did I turn it on? Did I somehow unsilence it? Oh well. There we go. Maybe I broke the silencer. That's also an option, maybe. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. I'm not here for your life now. This went bad. Ooh, cassette. An Afghan lullaby. Where's the jet? Oh, there he is, probably. Where's my... There we go. No, turn it off. Turn it off? There we go. I found you, buddy. There. That's the target. Fuck. Why must you disappoint me? Go to sleep. <laughs> oh no, he's got a gun. Uh, no! You son of a bitch, you're ruining everything. They were all gonna be alive. Got him. Let the support unit help out if you need to restock. Transport 
transmit a request from your ID. You asshole, I'm trying not to kill everybody here. Oh shit! <laughs> How do I get out of here? Oh god. Uh huh. We'll be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Everyone just go back to sleep. It's cool. It's cool. We got this. Alright, well, I'm outside. Can I just extract him? Is that how this works? Yep. Hi. Well, since things have already gone to shit, I think I'm gonna get myself a diamond. They're gonna- they're gonna taunt me with it like that. Looks like the enemy's lost sight of you. They're gonna try to hunt you down. Yeah, they will. Dude's in a hurry. Uh, they're using a hurry in the wrong direction, though. Yeah! Oh, it's small. Sometimes the important things in life in life are small or something. Uh, well, I've probably killed the tenants of a lot of these buildings, right? <laughs> I mean, if I've already, I've already, if I've already fucked everything up, I might as well loot. Anyone living in here right now? Sweet. This is probably important or something. Communications devices. I don't know. It's blown up for reasons. There we go. Even if it's not important, I have a C4 to spare. There's no one look over here real quick, and I'm just gonna take a look around. Sound kosher to you? Oh. Disappoint me, buildings. I wanted you to all be completely packed with fat loots. And you are not, in fact, doing such a thing. Oh. Oh, did the other one have a cassette in it? That I didn't notice? Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Well, now I've got to check, right? There you are. Did I just not walk up to you correctly? No, this one doesn't seem to be usable. Alright. Someone's walking nearby. No sign of hostiles? How suspicious. You better check again. Sweet. Well, now that I've disappointed my, now that I've disappointed everyone by failing to be the legendary stealth hero, uh, big boss, I'm just gonna make a run for it now. Bye. Bye bye. What do we have over here? Oh, cool, nice open area. Let's see. My objective, I assume, is to, yep, leave the zone. Look at all those things I got. Sweet. R&D's level 6. Oh. No fall. No fall. Hey, we got all those supplies. So you know what? We're benefiting and we're accomplishing goals. So I'm just gonna accept that. Oh, last time that I went loud I got a B, which is the same score, st score I was getting when I was going mostly stealth anyway. I'm just gonna have to accept my own mediocrity. Uh, careful. There we go. Auf Wiedersehen! Am I out of the zone yet? Do I win? <gasps> Is that a doggy? Oh, it's a sheep. Sheepy, 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 sheepy. So you surprise him is worn out. That gun will 
won't be as loud as any other now. If you have to shoot, be careful. My first thought was to stealth it, and I'm like, I'm, I was, I'm like, I'm gonna sneak, I'm gonna. I thought I was going to suppress. Uh, I was, what am I trying to say? I was gonna dart it and knock it out. I'm like, ah, oh, it's fine. I'll just send them into space. I'll have a dumb little zoo. And I'm like, oh, I don't have any trans. Uh, I don't really have any tranquilizer darts. Well, I still want to shoot it, so I guess this is happening. Where's my horse? I love that you just spawn off camera like Alex Vance or whatever her name was again, Elizabeth from Bioshock Infinite. It's so much more convenient. Roche is like, I have to spawn 500 feet away. No enemy forces in pursuit. Mission complete. You're goddamn right. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. Mission complete, boss. Still got a B. I get a B when I'm loud, I get a B when I'm quiet. Maybe I just don't need to overthink it so much. It is kind of funny. It's This game's always entertaining to me because it's always in two states. It's either in the constant sense of tension of, oh god, when's it going to go wrong? I'm I'm doing I'm been in stealth for so long, but at any moment it can break or like 2 seconds later, oh god, everything is going wrong. And this is an this is now amusing to me for completely different reasons. 25 her 2500 heroism. Whatever that means. The engineer we rescued has been extremely cooperative. The guys on the R&D team are glad to have him aboard. The thing is, his specialty is in mechanics, but something called bionics, engineering based on biology. He's already submitted a proposal for modifying your prosthetic arm. If you're interested, go ahead and give the development order. His specialty is bionics. And when you punch people with your melee combo, you use the, you use the sound from the Bionic Man, I believe. Unless I'm getting the, the wrong name there. So now I can expand on prosthetic arms and on my base itself. We're learning things. And he speaks Russian, which is handy. And he's a B-rank character, which is less than amazing. But hey, he made my... Really? My arm was made by a B-rank character? We're, that's not how Japanese anime stories work. He's got to be the bestest smith in all of the land. Ooh. And those are the guys I kidnapped. Because that's how I roll. When you're not on a mission, use that free time wisely. Surveying enemy outposts, for example. Or gathering manpower and resources. Of course, even you need some downtime every now and then. Whatever you do, it's all another step on the road to our goal. We were lucky to get our hands on that cyborg arm developer. There's no one in Diamond Dogs who can so much as maintain that thing. Bionic arm, not cyborg, if you go by what he calls it. But you're right, the East is light years ahead in bionics. They can even detect through the skin the slight electrical signals from the brain that order muscles to move. The Soviet Union completed their first bionic arm capable of doing that back in the 60s. Although I guess that news didn't really reach the West. No kidding. Zdornov's was the only one I ever saw. Quite a shock to see it for the first time. And it was no mean feat to get hold of Snake's arm. I couldn't get one for you at the time, but you know, now... Forget it. I've no intention of relying on bionics. Right now I need to keep the pain fresh in my mind. Well, it's your decision. But don't you find it... inconvenient? Not a bit. But the phantom pain... It never lets up. Do you know how many men I saw die that day? There's nothing we can do to bring them back. And you expect me to care about getting a measly arm and leg back? <sighs> Sorry. But my pain belongs to all our dead comrades. I'll keep living with it for their sake. It'll guide me straight and true until I've gotten them the vengeance they deserve. 